Uh, I want people to know that actions like this are not only happening here in Oakland, it's happening back on the East Coast in Philadelphia. And that's because this is an international day of action. Mumia's court hearing is coming up April 30th. The Philadelphia Fraternal Order of Police, as Jeremy said, are going to mobilize. When they mobilize, they go to the courthouse with their guns. That's how they mobilize, to intimidate people. And so there's an international day of action today, not only in the U.S., but in Britain, in France, in Germany, in South Africa. And here is a message from the brothers and sisters of Japan, the Japanese Railway Workers Union, Dora Chiba. Dear brothers and sisters, your struggle for freedom of Mumia Jamal, including the ILWU's port shutdown in 1999, the legal battle to force the court to order the Philadelphia DA's office to produce the DA's documents, and furthermore, the coming May Day action by ILWU Local 10 greatly inspired the Japanese labor movement. Internationally united, we can win freedom for Mumia and Hoshino. Hoshino is an anti-imperialist fighter who was imprisoned for protesting the U.S. troops in Japan during the Vietnam War. That's right, he's been in jail for almost a half a century. So we, they demand freedom not only for Mumia, but for Hoshino as well. And so, Dora Chiba is one of the militant unions, like ILWU Local 10. They came here when ILWU initiated the Million Worker March in Washington, D.C., 2004.